Hey guys, Fear Strike here with day number two of Project Chaos Marauder. I got my first 10 Marauders painted. And I feel like I'm saying that word wrong, Marauder. It's a hard word to say for me. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, the first 10, it took some time because I was doing one model a day until today, which I did three models, which are on the far left, but I'll show you guys in a second. Uh, I just want to show you guys before that, before the Marauders, what I've been, Marauders, what I've been using. So I have one shade and seven paints, Draking Off Nightshade, Gating Flesh Tone, Bugman's Glow, White Scar, Lead Belcher, Eschen Gray, Dried Bark, and can we see Alatok Blue, which I used on my Tyranids. So they're kind of going through the warp storm into the old world to be painted on my Marauder. So it's a very simple color scheme. It kind of reminds me of my Island of Blood Skaven, which I used like this pretty much the same, same color scheme, except I think I was using Ultramarine's blue, blue instead. So yeah, without further ado, I will take you in to show you these guys. So yeah, it was, I, I like this project because um, I'm taking my pace with it. I have 30 more, but I'm taking my time with it. I'm not rushing it. And sometimes it's, sorry, I'm just blocking everything. Uh, sometimes it's good to paint like one model a day so you can be proud of that progress. I'm gonna pick these guys up after. So, so a lot of the guys' heads are from from the Marauder kit, but a lot of them are from Space Wolves, which I'll show you. So this is just one of the guy, and I converted all the weapons to double-handed kind of uh, thing. So this is one of those Space Wolves heads. The only thing is they have that kind of power armor on the back of their neck, so I just painted it blue to have like a scarf kind of look to it, or neck neck piece of clothing. This guy's from the monitor. I like how unique these... The poses are all kind of monopose, but adding these extra Space Wolf heads and uh, converting the flails into thing make them even look even better, I think, than the original. And they originally were going to be corn, but then I decided to use teat, cinch, cinch, or however you say it, instead, because we're going through a lot of changes in the world right now with the whole situation. And um, yeah, that's a god I, I mean, also the blue was kind of from the, these are the three guys I painted just before I made this video. I mean, blue is just what I had too, but to change is blue and yeah we're going for a lot of change i'm going for a lot of changes i left my previous job and want to do something else that's more fulfilling you know and hobbing and warhammer is part of that but um yeah it's it's just i feel like that's this time and after this all this is done we're going to have a different world so that's another reason why i have Cinch warriors and yeah so i get and as i said i had blue so Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you guys like it. I'll probably won't post right away, maybe in 10 days after I did the next 10 and then the next 10 and the next 10. So it's going to be a long project, but yeah. Anyways, peace and thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.